Hi, my name is Aoife and I am delighted to be back with I Love Cooking making this gorgeous Christmas dessert. So today we are making a sticky toffee pear pudding with a delicious sticky toffee sauce. So the first thing I'm going to do is prep my pears. So I have peeled my pears already here and I've taken out the core from the inside and pop them in a pan and I'm going to add my aromatics. So I'm using a pear cider. So all of that goes in and this just gives a really lovely pear flavor. I've got some port as well, which is lovely and Christmassy. And then I have some spices. So I have star anise, clove, and then I'm popping in some uh, orange zest and lemon zest as well. So I have some sugar to sweeten, brown sugar. And I'm just gonna pop in some lemon juice as well and that just stops the pears going brown. So I'm gonna pop this on the heat to poach for about 15 to 20 minutes until they are nice and soft. So the next part is the sponge and the first part of a sticky toffee pudding is the sticky dates. So the first thing I have done is I have soaked my dates and these have been soaking in boiling water for about five to 10 minutes. So that just helps them blend into a really lovely puree. So I'm gonna pop this in a food processor with all the water, everything, and I'm gonna blend it up. Okay, so that is lovely and smooth now. So my dates are pureed, so I'm gonna move on to my sponge. First thing, butter. Then we have brown sugar. And I'm going to cream those together for a second till they're lovely and creamy. And then once they're nicely combined, I'm gonna add my eggs one by one. So with the beater still running, the machine still running. And then my second egg. Okay. Then I'm gonna add my date puree straight in. This is nice and cool now. Give it another mix. And then I'm gonna pop my dry ingredients in. So I have self-raising flour here, which I'm just gonna whack in. I've sieved this already. Some baking powder. And then my lovely Christmassy spices. So I have ground ginger, ground cinnamon, and I have some allspice as well. So we'll mix that all together and that is the sponge done. So my sponge mix is ready and my pears have gently been poaching. So these are nice and soft. I'm gonna pop my sponge mix straight in the baking dish. Oh, it smells like Christmas. Okay. And then I'm gonna take my pears and gently nestle them in and around the sponge. So that's why I've trimmed off the bases so they can stand up like that. And I've kept the stalks on. I think it just looks really nice as well once it's baked. Yeah. So I'm just gonna pop that into the oven at 160 degrees fan for about 35 minutes. Okay, so now for the sticky toffee sauce. I have brown sugar straight in the pan with some cream, butter, and a little bit of treacle. And the treacle just gives it a lovely sticky richness. So straight in. And then that is just brought to the boil for about two to three minutes until it is lovely and thick. Mm -hmm. 
So the sauce is lovely and silky and glossy now, so I'm just gonna leave that to the side until my sponge is cooked. So that is my sticky toffee pear pudding and toffee sauce. So I hope you enjoyed this recipe. If you make this at home, make sure you tag us and I hope you have a lovely Christmas. Thank you.